All right, people, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in to another one here on the Coach's Desk. We appreciate you being here. And we're going to give you some updates on what will be taking place on this weekend's Diamond League Showcase. Yes, man, Diamond League Showcase. It's going to be epic. It's going to be interesting. And it's also going to be shocking because... I mean, some of the people that we expected to be in, in some of these events, they are not for whatever reason. But before we get into the details, please remember to like, share and subscribe to the channel. And we want to talk about two events in this one. And you'll be getting more updates as we go by. Two events that we'll be talking about. The men's 110 meter hurdles as well as the women's 100 meter hurdles. So let's kick start it with the men's 100 meter uh, and 10 meter hurdles because it, it, it is quite interesting that um, Grant Holloway, yes, Grant Holloway will not be a part of that because from what we understand, and he made that post on social media that, I mean, there was some sort of negotiation in terms of um, appearance um, participation and what it takes for them to be for him to be there and such the like apparently they did not come to some sort of agreement for that to occur and grant holloway will not be at the event you'll not be in the finals you'll not be able to compete because uh, there was some sort of breakdown in negotiation and that is quite alarming and like he said he, he, he said this is what it, 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 it comes down to. I mean, it, it is not a good look for uh, track and field. And definitely, it, it, it puts the sport in a, in a bad light. You know what I mean? But let's talk about who will be competing. Daniel Roberts, um, he has been consistent this season, um, running 13.1 um, there about. So he, 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 he is one of the, 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 the overwhelming favorite in this one since Grant is not in. Sasha Zoya can spring uh, an upset in this one. However, he has to go very well to beat uh, Daniel Roberts. Cardell Tinch will be in this one. Freddie Crittenden is also going to be in this one. Izumiya um, is in this one. Lorenzo Siminoli, Siminoli uh, is going to be in this one. Michael Obesiu and Eric Edwards. When you look at the grand scheme of things, the top hurdlers are actually not in this final. And you wonder what would have caused that negotiation breakdown why Grant Holloway, he has been doing extremely well. He's one of the, 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 the persons that, uh, I mean, the fans go out to see. So why couldn't this negotiation uh, come through? Why did it have to fall through? You know what I mean? So I don't know what caused it. I, I'm, I'm merely speculating based off what um, he said. You know what I mean? But, I mean, it, it, it should have been sorted out. The fans want to see the best athletes competing. The fans want to see the big names uh, we could lighten it to the situation with Sydney. Sydney wanted to squeeze in into the into the grand scheme of things, you know. However, she couldn't. But what they did was to put her in an invitational race, and that is absolutely brilliant. Yeah, because you want the people want to see these athletes run. She's gonna run a two hundred. She's gonna run a four hundred. I don't know. They should have done all that it takes to get Grant Holloway competing. But again, I don't know the intricacies of the issue, so I'm just merely giving my opinion based of what Grant Holloway uh, actually opined. Now, when you look at the women's 100 meter hurdles, then definitely you are looking at an, a, a, an Olympic final. You're looking at a world championship final. You're just looking at a big race. You get to me? I say, this one is massive. This one is a massive rematch. This one um, signifies the greatest of the greatest this season in terms of Diamond League. Yeah, because, of course, Masai is not there um, for whatever reason. She's not there. The Olympic champion is not in this one. And it's also another sad scene to see the Olympic champion not being in this one. Again, persons will say, oh, she has nothing to prove. Yes, but she was actually running after the Olympic Games. So it, it should have continued. But definitely... I'm not going to dwell too much on that one. Uh, all I know is that Akira Nugent and Jasmine Kamacha Queen, it is going to be an epic battle. It's going to be the battle of technicality. Yeah, Jasmine um, would have won the last um, outing. Uh, 
Akira won another outing in, 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 in Zagreb, I believe. So she's doing pretty well. She has been unbeaten after the, uh, the Olympic Games. So certainly she would want to end the season on a high. She would want to end the season being the Diamond League champion. And that argues well from a Jamaican standpoint. I, I, I suspect that if she is the Diamond League champion, then uh, Jamaica will have in their armory uh, uh, another three athletes, another three 100-meter uh, uh, hurdlers who could be a part of a wonderful team going forward for the Jamaicans. So definitely Akira, she has been in, in fine form, unbeatable form since uh, the Olympic. And uh, certainly she's looking to go all out in this one. I mean, if, 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 if she wants to end the season well, she has to take this title. And I look forward to see her competing in, one, in this one. Jasmine Kamacha Queen, she's absolutely brilliant as well. And it's going to be a fierce battle. Yeah. Serena um, Samba Mehela, she's not going to allow these athletes to take all the spotlight. She will want to actually break the hearts of these top athletes. And definitely, she has the ability, she has the propensity to do so. The technicality, yes, she has it to do so as well. Danielle Williams, two-time um, world athletics champion, definitely over the 100 meter hurdles. She has the capability and the tenacity and the, the vim and the competitiveness to do this as well. So I certainly believe that this one can be a massive showdown. And again, Daniel Williams would also want to break the hearts of the uh, favorites in this one. And definitely you can't put anything past Daniel Williams in it because Daniel Williams will just show up. And the beauty about the hurdles you know, is that you don't have one athlete just dominating. Yeah, you don't have that. So it, 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 because it's a, it's, it's, an, it's a technical event then it's who execute on the day certainly will show their cards and will be the top person. You have Grace Stark, um, fabulous young sprinter. She's not doing um, too bad in this event. Uh, she, 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 she has been running some seconds, you know what I mean, and she has been doing her stuff. So certainly she can spring uh, the upset as well. Tony Marshall of the Star Athletics Camp, she definitely um, will be in this one. And she can she spring a surprise? Well, I'm not seeing that. But again, it's a technical event, so anything can happen. Barriers are there. And it's one of the hardest events to actually call. Um, Nadine Vizer is also going to be in this one. And Pia Shurzaskwa, she is also going to be in this one. And this event will take place on September 14th. So, you're going to have your soup. And you're going to sit down on your couch. And you are going to ensure that you watch this one. Listen, when these ladies match, match up. It is always something special. So I'm looking forward to a wonderful um, 100 uh, uh, meter hurdles. And also the men, we're looking for a good one. But it, 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 it lacks firepower because of the absence of, of some of the top hurdlers. But it is what it is. And we just have to work with it as is. So your thoughts on this one, people. Who are you picking? Will you be picking Akira? Will you be picking Jasmine, Daniel, uh, Samba Mehela, Grace Stark? Will you be picking uh, Daniel Roberts or Sasha Zoya? Share your comment in the comment section. Until next time, I'm out.